Hi again. This video is to introduce the final assignment in this course and the only graded assignment. As mentioned in the first assignments video, due to Coursera's payment structure, this assignment is only available to those of you who have paid for the course. This assignment will ask you to do some of the same things you've done in previous assignments, but now you're going to do them on your own. Ultimately, the end result will be a map package suitable for sharing with others, namely your peers who will be grading your assignment. I will provide a prompt and some starting information, but unlike with the previous three assignments, getting to the end is entirely up to you. It's important to note that there may not be one right way to do things, so you have to think through your GIS skills to come up with a solution. I wanna say one final thing about grading. For those of you who haven't done a Coursera peer review before, the way it works is that you submit your assignment for grading. You then need to grade a few other people based on the rubric that we provide you before you can get your own grade. Please give your peers the same attention to grading and feedback as you would want for your own assignment. The rubric will lay out very specific grading criteria. Please stick to them and don't let other factors sneak into any of the explicitly graded items. I also want to note that this course is going to have people from all around the world in it and you will undoubtedly encounter situations where the English in a map is not perfect. This is okay. I don't want anyone to be marked down because their title had poor grammar or something. Instead, if they can communicate in the language of maps based on the rubric provided, they should pass the class. Okay, good luck. If you run into any trouble, you can still ask your course mates for help in the course forum. Have fun.